3rd for 12 Mountain Standard Time. Girl, I'm acting like y'all coming on. I'm being really quiet because it is early here. Hold on. Let me log in. Um, it is early and some new developments in our household, y'all, things always change. Um, let me just say this. Remember a couple of, I don't even know if I mention it. I don't know if I mention it, but we had scheduled to have our, before stuff hit the fan, we had scheduled to have our guest bathroom redone. Ciao. So my husband, sorry, sorry, my coffee. My husband is going ahead with the plans and I said, do you think that's a good idea? And so um, we spoke with the guy. He's a young guy, he has a young family and he's had, everyone has counseled on him but us. So you guys, I'm praying about it. It's, he's coming today, so it's too late at this point, but I prayed about it. I'm just gonna, look, I'm covering everybody, covering him, covering his family. And he works with one other person. Um, and the thing, the good thing about it is that he's going to be in the guest bathroom where we really don't go in that much. And so it's going to take about, he said about six days to finish the entire guest bathroom. It's going to basically mimic our master bathroom. Um, so, you know, I need to look at this. Don't be fearful. Okay. I need to look at this as an opportunity to support someone with a young family, a small business owner during the time to work. This will probably be his only means of income for a couple of weeks, okay? So, um, and then when he leaves every day, I will be wiping everything down. So you guys, we have decided, we decided last night to pull JV out of the school care, even though there's not a lot of kids, even though they're constantly washing their hands, but children, and, and children are not as, um, their symptoms are very mild. I think there's only been one child one too many that has passed away from the coronavirus but the thing is that children are carriers so he could bring it home to me he could bring it home to a neighbor um and so we're gonna pull him out <sighs> with that being said it's gonna be it's gonna be interesting and the thing you know the fact of the matter is that this is a new territory for all of us all of us are going through it which means that i'm pretty sure these teachers are expecting some amount of regression from the students they are not expecting us to go into 2021 school year, everyone on board. It's not going to be that way um, because we did get a email from the principal basically stating that we're going to be out. Like I told y'all, we're going to be out now until April. That's not going to happen. My gut instinct is telling me that we will be out for the rest of the school year. To, please expect that because think about it. China just now got to a point to where they have no new cases. They've been going through this stuff since January, y'all. We just started self-quarantining last week. You expect us to come back in April? Not happening. <sighs> so we did get his school lessons in for the day. The thing that's a little frustrating as someone who likes to plan out her days and weeks, I can't plan now with his online education because they don't send the assignments until the day of. And today is a lot that's due. Again, we won't be doing everything today. I guess my point is, is that we're doing something, but we're not stressed out doing everything. I know a couple of people on my, and she's actually an educator. She's actually a child child care director. She said all, all the things she's doing with her kids is talking to them, reading. She is not enforcing anything on her children. I was like, oh, but you know whatever so let me show y'all what we had to do last last week all right can y'all see this oh yes honey so this is what was all due last week oh but it ain't just that i click on this it brings me up to an uh view details if i go to view detail view details excuse me i have several items in here that we have to do for this one particular category okay so we have Several here. One, two, three, four, five, six, twelve plus. Again, let's click on something like this. So for this example, he had to read um, 
excuse me, watch this video. Then we had to fill out a form, two forms actually, and then I had to upload it, which you see right here. So yes, this is stuff like all these items were due for one day. If I didn't get the math assignment done, then I loaded it, I loaded it up on Saturday. But as you can tell here, everything here, you, you really can't see that well, excuse me, everything here is turned in, so we're good. But I'm not stressing out getting everything done on a daily basis. We're doing what we can, okay? I found something right over here. I didn't notice it till I moved my car. What in the world? You see what it says? I miss you, JV. I wonder who that could have been. How sweet is that? I think it was Taryn. Maybe. Yeah. Is Miss Lori's granddaughter. That is so sweet. Here, you can turn around, you can get up. I have sticky notes here. You take the sticky note and place it under the column you think it goes under to make it plural. Think about the sound and think about no, when me. you have a box. What do you see? Mm -hmm, yeah, you can see all of them. Would you add an S or an EX to box? Look at the rules. Look at the rules here too. Those are the rules. Those are the golden rules. If it ends in C, if it ends in C H S S H X or Z, you add E S. Oh, that's correct, baby. Okay. What's the next word? What's that word you have? You need to tell them what it is. Match. Yeah, I was gonna say. Oh. Match. Match. Focus so the, right now. Yeah, it's focusing. So again, if it ends in C H S S H X or Z, you add an E S. Anything else, you add an X. How many you have left? Mm -hmm. Oh child, I'm about to I'm about to go to sleep. <laughs> Got three more or four more? Um, four. Oh Lord. <laughs> Keep going. What word is that? Hand. 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 So how will we make it plural? Sound it out next to the letters. Would it be hands or handness? Look at the rules. Wish. You want to show them real quick? Okay. Is that right? <laughs> the wishes. Wishes. I'm not telling you. Oh, wishes. Okay. We can do it. <laughs> so you did so good, JB. You get a, you get a sticker. <gasps> you get a sticker. Yay! Let me get you a sticker, okay? Girl, hold on, y'all. I know y'all can't really see me. Hold on, let me get myself. I, I am so freak. I'm about to do so much emotional eating right now. I, I just can't handle it. Hold on, y'all. It's, it's zooming in, zooming in, zooming in. Woo! Homeschooling went better as the day went on. Let me back up. So what I did was I switched it up a little bit. I did the challenging part for him, which is English and we reserved the math for later on because he's a whiz at math. And so it's better. We actually got done an hour sooner. We were done by 12.30. We were done to us two hours sooner than what we initially did. We started, yeah, because we started at 9.30 and we were done by 12.30. That included a bunch of breaks. So that was really good. It was a struggle at first. Y'all heard me complain. It was a struggle and I think it will remain a struggle when we first start, but it gets better. Let me tell you something. Hold on, let me get situated. Y'all gonna catch me on the news. I am so, this man, my husband, he done hit my car again. He comes inside. Now I'm, I'm looking at um, 
I look pregnant, y'all. I'm, I'm, I'm eating too much. I look, I look about, I look like I'm in my second trimester. That's, I'm getting out of control. My, cause my weight goes to my stomach, my arms, and my, and the rest of the titties I have left. So, those of you who, who are new to my channel, my husband has an accident at least once a year, minimum once a year. Typically, he hits someone. Either he's backing out. He can't drive. The ninja can't drive for shit. He needs to get a damn Uber, a pony and horse, a bicycle, something else besides getting into a damn car. Let me calm down because the man is still working on the house. Yeah, let me, let me break it down. So, he comes in the house, right, calling me because I'm looking at something. I have my earphones on. I can barely hear him. He's like, you need to move your car. He said, like, I can't back out. I'm like... But you, you got in pretty well, buddy. So I'm like, whatever, let me go ahead and move my car. As I'm walking out, I see him rubbing the side of my car. White streak, uh, cause that's the paint kind of scratching. I'm like, what the? I said, what the hell were you doing? He said, like, I can't see, you didn't park there, right? I said, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Were you able to get in here pretty good last night? He comes home in the dark. You were able to get up in here pretty good, right? He said, yeah, but it's different when you're back. I said, wait a minute, you have a camera. Not only does he have a camera, he has a sensor that beep, beep, beeps when your ass get too close to a car. Y'all, the car is okay. Mama, mama. Let's see what. You know what? Mm -mm. Let me show you guys what the bathroom looks like. Look, every day this man leaves, I clean everything. I bleach, I spray down, I Lysol, and I clean my floors. This is the third day in a row. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not playing. So this is what it looks like so far, you guys. We have the two shelves here. He said he could do three. I think two will be enough because the bathtub is a little bit water. So we have a new bathtub, new towel, and then we're gonna do the rock border around here to match the uh, master bathroom. And yeah, this would be very, very nice. Girl, my shower videos are gonna be lit. You tell me, once this is up and running next week, I'm gonna re re be recording several videos in the shower for y'all. Hold on y'all. Turn this down. That's Molly Music and, and Jasmine Sullivan, girl. So y'all, we are at Walmart. Oh, the blood of Jesus. <laughs> I have not been to Walmart in about a week. I know I look high yellow, but we'll, we'll adjust that later on. I have not been to Walmart in about a week. Um, the last time I was here, I had to wait in line to get in. Yeah, so I went to Fry's two days ago, and I know they're saying to only go to the grocery store once a week at this point. Let me, hold on y'all. That's a little bit better. They are suggesting here in the States to only go to the grocery store once a week. But two days ago, I did go to Fry's. I was, JB is so young, he still likes to touch every dang on thing. I had no other choice to take him with me to the grocery store because my husband is still working. He has to go to work. And so, um... Well, I'm, I lost my train of thought. So I had to put him in the in the buggy or the cart. We say buggy in East Texas. And you know another thing that I noticed? We say tissue paper in certain parts of the, of the South. Tissue paper. I was listening to um, Donna's Journey. She says tissue paper. She grew up in East, in um, uh, Shreveport, which is very close to East Texas, like 30 minutes away. So when I was saying tissue, when it, shit was popping off, excuse me, when stuff was popping off here a couple of days ago, and I was saying tissue paper, people didn't know what I was saying. They were like, what? I said toilet paper, whatever. We say tissue paper, whatever. So, um... What was I talking about? So anyway, yeah, I was here. Uh, so two days ago, I did go to Fry's, but I had JB to sit in the bed of the of the cart or the buggy so that he wouldn't touch everything. Girl, I had on my mask. I had everything ready. It, this was like one o'clock in the afternoon too. So things have kind of slowed down um, as far as the the urgency to get products to stockpile. But I'm gonna take y'all with me to see what they have. I have quite a bit to get. Quite a bit to get which is another reason why I left JB home. I'm trying to find my, this is not. Yeah. 
we're at JB school so what they're going to be doing is a wave by the teachers are going to be waving at the students I know a lot of schools in the valley are doing this probably all over the country by valley y'all we refer to Phoenix as the valley um I know they're gonna be doing this in a lot of the schools and so girl at first I was like you know what I ain't got time <laughs> This is not for me though. This is for my child. Um, so I have a record. JB bought his record to show her. <laughs> Lord. We actually need to go in and get something, but I'll just come back up here tomorrow. His school is very close by, so it's not bad. Y'all, I've been up in my skin regimen, girl. Oh my battery's low. Let me turn this off till it's time then. Here they go. You can you can get out your out your seatbelt, boo boo, if you want to. You can get out your seatbelt. He <laughs> said TV. All right, you guys, here is the finished bathroom. Excuse the background. My child's going crazy, he's playing. So, really, really nice. I absolutely love it. Now, this is very similar to our, ma actually, it's the same thing as our master bathroom. We want everything to be very basically duplicated. Um, it is a bigger bathtub, very nice. We have little shelves here. He wanted to know if we wanted to have um, three shelves. I said, no, two is enough because I have room here along the border and of course i made sure to have a filter put in on this shower y'all the, the water in arizona is in phoenix in general is so horrible so this is what the bathroom looks like now i do have i have a shower curtain of course it's going to go up i'm going to purchase a new shower rod um uh, i'm still debating whether or not i want to get a new shower curtain i think i'm going to because right now the shower the shower curtain excuse me this child's so loud. It's like a greenish color. I think I'm gonna aim for like a grayish green. Um, or maybe, I don't think I wanna do brown because brown is everywhere. I wanna do like a grayish green color and then I have tassels coming in. So, what the? And then I, sorry y'all, I have tassels coming in to help secure the curtain. I think I'm gonna have it going this way to the left girl um because i want people to be able to see the decorative brick and the shower because it looks really nice so yeah you guys i'm gonna end this vlog here um and i hope you guys are staying safe and taking care of yourself okay